Good morning, students. So today, Celestia will be performing for us. So let us hear from Celestia. Celestia, you're ready, right? Yes, ma'am. Okay, you can start now. The poem I'm going to recite is Nature by William Henry David. What if this life is full of fear? We have no time to stand and fear. No time to stand beneath the boat and steer as long as shape and color. No time to see when words be past, where squirrels hide their nuts in grass. No time to see in broad daylight things full of stars like skies at night. No time to turn at beauty's friends and watch her feet, how they can dance. No time to wait till her mouth can and reach as much her eyes began. A poor life is, is full of fear. We have no time to stand and fear. Thank you. Celestia done? Done, ma'am. Okay. It, it was written by whom? William Henry Davis. Okay, okay, okay. Very good. Please give me a round of applause for Celestia. So on my next class, Gayatri, please get ready. Gayatri, can you hear me? Gayatri, can you hear me or Gayatri is absent? Jiban, Gayatri is absent? Gayatri, you are present, right? I could see you. Gayatri, can you hear me? Okay, okay. Okay, so uh, yesterday we have discussed about the like fracture, no? so we will be continuing with that. Okay, so so Jiban, what we have discussed yesterday? What what are the topic that we have discussed yesterday? Types of fractures. Okay. We have discussed about the definition. We have about uh, discussed about the causes. We have discussed about the some of yes, the types. Huh? Yes, ma'am. Okay, so and then we also uh, in the types we have discussed. I think close and open fracture as well as stable and unstable fracture right okay so yes, okay so before like uh, giving you all the another point uh, so i would like i i would like to ask this uh, driti raj about the causes of fracture driti raj can you hear me i just hope you won't act like you could not hear okay driti raj can you hear me yes ma'am Okay, Pritiras, can you please tell me the causes of fracture, which I have explained yesterday? Say fast. Ma'am, I'm sorry, I was absent, ma'am. Okay, but still I hope, like, uh, you have viewed my this one video, now. If you're absent also, like, maybe you are sick or whatever it is, but still, I always send the link, right? You never open that? Yes, ma'am. If you won't read the class, then it might, like, affect your, this one, att attendance. Yes, ma'am. Okay, always listen. I have said, only to be listen. Karne me kya jata hai? Already, we have taken the class and ready made video is being uploaded in the YouTube. You just need to view it. Isn't it, Riti Raj? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Okay, uh, who would like to tell me the causes of fracture? Hurry up, please. If you all won't know, then I'll ask for her. Say. Direct and indirect. Mode. Okay, direct force and indirect force. Okay, Jiban, what do you mean by direct force? Hurry up. Direct force by, um, by kicking or punching them. Okay, the, the, force that, force. the force that we directly apply upon the any part of the area of our body, isn't it? Maybe because of yes, punch or kick. Okay, In, what is indirect force, Jiban? Indirect. Indirect, uh, indirect force may be meant by twisting or by falling down, ma'am. Okay. Uh, can you please tell me what are the certain bone diseases that can also make our bones very brittle and break, okay? With, even if we won't apply much force also, like it breaks very easily. So because of disease. Well, so what was the name of the disease? ma'am. Osteo? Osteoporosis, ma'am. Okay, very good, Jiman. Okay. So next, let me ask you, Pohor. Pohor, can you please tell me the types of fracture, only the name? Hurry up. 
अरे पोहर क्या हुआ वट है ओके ओके क्यों था कैन यू प्लीज टेल मी द आंसर टाइप ऑफ फ्रैक्चर ओनली द नेम ओनली द नेम क्यों था सुरक्षा कैन यू प्लीज टेल मी सुरक्षा यस मैम या सर जस्ट टेल मी द नेम मैम क्लोज एंड ओपन ओके एंड व्हाट इज द अदर वन द अदर वन मैम Yeah, yeah. Suraksha, I guess you are having an issue. No problem. Can you just please say the answer? Uh, repeat the uh, question, ma'am. The question is what are the uh, what are the types that I have taught you for fracture? Types of fracture. The uh, types fracture. Yeah, yeah. Just the name. If you don't know, I'll pass the question to someone else. Let's not waste time. You know or you don't know. Ma'am, I can tell. Yes, cost of seed answer. Hurry up. Ma'am, ma'am, open. Ma'am, uh, <coughs> open fracture, close fracture, and yeah. displaced fracture. Displaced fracture. What about stable? I mean, some stable fractures also there. And and what is the opposite of stable? Yeah. Ma'am, unstable fracture. Yes, very good. Okay, so that was all about we have discussed, na. So whatever we have discussed, we have to rewind it back. Otherwise, naya sikte rehne se purana jo sikha hai, bhul jaane se to what is the use of teaching, isn't it? So some of you even uh, even could not even like reply also. Like it's so uninteresting, you know. You teach and then like when you ask the question and you can't even like reply it back. Okay, the last continue. So. today uh, i will be like teaching you all the continuation of the types right so yesterday we very hurriedly we have discussed about the stable and unstable fracture so all of you you still remember what is the uh, what is, what was the stable and unstable fracture if no we'll have a slight revision stable and unstable uh, fracture we remember ma'am remember okay very good okay so so stable and unstable i have shown you all the pictures also so today like uh, we will discuss about the other uh, other types of fracture okay apart from this there are like lots and lots of like fractures okay so let us discuss one by one so i'll be like showing all the pictures i'll be showing all the can you see the picture yes ma'am yes ma'am yes ma'am Okay. Uh, these are just I have collected some uh, many types. Okay, but I'll teach you all only the important important ones. So when uh, our bone is fractured normally, okay, when we have a fracture, but the fracture is normal, okay. So this is the normal. This is a normal bone. Okay. This is our normal bone. So can you see the screen nicely, all of you? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Okay. I'll ask you. Okay, this this is very important types of fracture. So transverse. Can you see the this the picture of transverse? So from the yes, picture, from the bone itself, or what you can define? See, bone case a break wa hai. Dikhai diya na? So can you please tell me any hints? Any hints? Straight How the man. bone is break? Any hints? Straight, ma'am. Yes, very good. So, uh, transverse fra fracture. Okay, these are a type of fracture when, like, uh, when a straight break occur. Okay, it means a straight break is occur across our bone. So, the break is straight. Or you can just simply simply write like this: a straight break right across a bone. Okay, that is known as transverse fracture. A straight break right across a bone. So. If I tell you to draw the draw the this uh, draw transverse fracture, draw the diagrams of transverse fracture, then uh, just try to remember, Miss. Oh, transverse fracture. So, oh, the brain, the uh, bone break. Hota hai, sida means straight break. Hota hai. Then, if you like memorize in that way, then you will be uh, very helpful for you all to draw the image or draw the diagram of that particular fracture. So, this is what uh, transverse fracture is. Are you clear? What is transverse fracture? 
Yes, yes. The, just yes, the bone, yeah. yeah, a straight break occur right across a bone. That is all about transfers. Okay, next one is oblique, okay? So oblique fracture. So oblique fracture, yesterday I told Carly to draw something. So can anyone guess oblique, oblique fracture? Okay, student, can you hear me? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Yes, ma'am. I was having a network issue. I don't know what happened nowadays. There are always network problem and... Okay, you can see now again? Yes, yes ma'am. Ma yes, ma'am. Okay, so we were discussing about the oblique, this oblique fractures, right? So oblique fracture, can anyone guess? How the fracture is occurred? Yesterday, Carly have drawn something. So can anyone guess? Diagonal break, man. Yes, very good. It's diagonal, na see? It's a straight to nahi hai na? Ye diagonal is see. So it's diagonally. So the fracture that is diagonal to a bone long axis, okay? To a bone long axis, you can write down. A fracture that is diagonal to a bone long axis. Just write down. The fracture that is diagonal to a bone long axis. That is diagonal to a bone long axis. So means fracture will occur, but the fracture uh, how it occur it the how to say the the structure looks like that of the like uh, the break look like that of the diagonal break okay so it look like the like diagonal type are you clear all of you obli yes ma'am yes ma'am can, yes, ma can you differentiate between transverse and oblique from the picture Yes, yes, okay. Coming to the next. Next is the spiral fra fracture. Okay. Spiral fracture. So spiral fracture is a type of fracture, okay? Where at least one part of the bone has been twisted. One part of the bone has been twisted. See, you can see that this the twist. One part of the bone has been twisted. So you, you can write it down. It is a fracture where at least one part of the bone has been twisted. You know now what is twist? Yes, ma'am. Yeah. Yes, ma so, that is all about the spiral fracture. Okay, coming to the next. Next is the comminuted uh, uh, fractures, okay? So by seeing the pictures, how can you define it? Anyone see the picture? How the how the breaks occur? Can anyone define it? Cracks, man. Yeah, in one or in many pieces. In many pieces, man. Yes, very good. So you can just write down that the bone is shattered into many pieces. The bone is shattered. S H A double T E R E D. S H A double T E R E D. Shatter. The bone is shattered into many pieces. So that is known as community uh, this fracture. Okay. When uh Hamara bone jab break hote hai na, bahut chota chota piece se alag alag jagah mein chota chota pieces mein jab break hote hai, then we call it as uh, we name or we call that particular kind of fracture as community fracture. So are you clear? Yes, ma'am. All of you? Ma'am, on the previous line, ma'am, it is the fracture. Which one is the part of? What is ma'am? Which one? Community? Yes, ma'am. Ma'am, it's the first one, ma'am. Spiral? It is the... Yes, ma'am. Oh, it is a fracture where at least one part of the bone has been twisted. One part of the bone has been twisted. Okay, ma'am. Okay, ma'am. Okay, so 
this was all about the transfer oblique spiral and community so by looking the like picture can, uh, you can understand it more clearly yes or no yes ma'am yes ma'am okay okay next next you see the green stick can you see the green stick fracture can you see the picture yes ma'am okay yes, ma can anyone guess what will how will you like can anyone guess what type of fracture it would be i mean like uh, how will you define this this also when you see the image no you you simply said that it is like uh, the bone is being break into many pieces no here also when you see you have mentioned straightly so now tell me about the green stick fracture crack on the side ma'am crack on this from this side okay um, what about others the bone isn't the bone say 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 does the bone fully break or it it break only partially 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 okay, very good okay partially so, ma'am okay good okay so green stick fracture you can just write down okay the bone partially the bone partially fracture on one side the bone partially or the part d you can write part d also p a r t l y p a r t l y the bone part on the bone partly p a r t l y the bone part d p a r t l y or partially you can, you can just try whatever you want the bone partly fracture on one side sirf ek side ki taraf ha comma but does not break completely but does not break completely but does not break completely full stop this is more common among children this is this is more common among children whose bones are softer and more elastic whose bones are softer and more elastic e l a s t i c dam or i need to repeat ma'am done ma'am done ma'am okay so green stick okay this green stick fracture it's very very simple these are a time of type of bone fracture which doesn't break completely it break only on one side okay and this type of break are very much common in children as compared to that of the adult okay it's very common because why this common because the uh, in children their bones are very very soft as compared to that of the like elderly okay their bones are softer and their bones are more elastic are you clear yes ma'am yes. okay. see the picture of toras can you see the picture of toras fracture yes ma'am yes ma'am okay. now tell me how will we define this how will we define see the picture you can see the figure okay it's swollen in the middle ma'am swollen in the middle okay is the bone normal abnormal any deformities is the normal or it is the deformed one is you could see the normal deformed ma'am yes very good okay so you can write it down okay toras 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 fracture uh you you could see the bone deform and uh, can you find any break over here can you find any break no ma'am no ma'am okay so write down uh bone deform 
you write thoracic fracture and you give like and and you write down okay bone deform d e f o r m s bone deform but does not crack bone deform but does not crack full stop more common in children more common in children full stop it is painful but stable it is painful but stable s t a b l e painful but stable are you done all of you yes ma'am yes ma'am okay so that means like from the picture you can just like define that uh, if you know the normal bone then you can just define that that the bone is deformed deformed and it does not crack okay and it is very very common in children as compared to the elderly age or old age or advanced age or an adult okay and this type of uh, if the bone deformity occurs then it is very very much painful but like you can handle it means you can stabilize it okay it can be stable right it, um, even though uh, means despite of being painful so are you clear yes ma'am yes ma'am okay so how much you have written till now how many point six all right how much Six minutes. Six. Okay. Have you written the spiral fracture? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma okay. Next, you next you try to write down this uh, this impacted fracture. Impacted fracture. Impacted fracture. Impacted. You see the diagram nicely. What comes in your mind? Impacted. Impacted fracture. What comes in your mind? You see where the fracture occurs. Happy Pisces, man. What did you say? Uh, crack in the epiphysis, man. Crack in the epiphysis. Okay, what about other? What about others? Any idea? Picture, they keep it in the mark. Do you know what is fragment, bone fragment? Do you know what is bone yes, fragment? Yes, ma'am. What is bone fragment? Uh, broken off part, ma'am. Broken off parts, is it? Is it? Yes, ma'am. Fragment would be defined like that, I think. Okay, you write down avulsion evul, fracture, you write down. A-V-U-L-S-I-O-N. Avulsion fracture. A Excuse me, ma'am. Yes, yes. Uh, you were explaining about impacted. Oh, I'm explaining about avulsion fracture. Avulsion. Oh, okay, ma'am. Oh, oh, impacted, right. Okay, okay, write down. I'm so sorry. Okay, okay. Impacted. Okay, write down. Write down. Write down. Impacted. See the write the spelling nicely. Impacted. When the bone is fractured, when the bone is fractured, comma, one fragment of bone goes into another. Very easy. When the bone is fractured. One fragment of bone goes into another. Finish. 
<clears throat> yes, yes ma'am. Ma okay. Carly, can you please explain? What do you mean by impacted fracture? Uh, here, a fragment from another bone is, uh, uh, it goes into another bone. Okay, thank you. Jiban, can you please explain? Jiban. Yes, in this fracture, ma'am. Yeah, see, see, yes, see, see. In this, in this fracture, ma'am. One part of the bone goes into the another part, ma'am. One part of the fracture is one one part of the fracture is goes into the, goes into goes into another another part of the bone. Yes, very good. So when 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 our bone is fractured, now one fragment of our bone, that particular fragment of the bones will goes into another, it goes into another, okay not into the same or whatever it is, but in the another bone, okay? In another, in another type or else in another bone, it will go and attach over there. That we call it as impact, these impacted fractures. So are you clear? Yes, ma'am. Okay, if you like, if you want to see the images also, there are lots of, lots of images. You can also Google it, okay, image. So these are the images that I have, but Apart from this, if you want to see more images, then you can see by yourself also. Okay. The main thing is you just need to understand. Are you clear? Yes, yes ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Okay. So, uh, so like this, uh, this uh, see the segmental fracture. You can also write segmental fracture if you want to know it all. Must. Much is not required, but still, if you want to write it down, you write down segmental fracture. Segmental fracture, S-E-G-M-E-N-T-A-L. Segmental fracture. Have you ever heard about segmental fracture? Have you ever heard? Yes, you, see, you can see the picture yes, too. It is very clear. Segmental fracture, this is a type of fracture is not it where at least two fracture you will see at least two fracture line before do you have seen only one one fracture line right see a, a quad meter fracture what hana yes sir but in the segmental yes, fracture what you will find is that uh, you will find at least uh, two fracture line see this is that is why we call it a segmental it's a segment segmental fracture we call it so you can just write down where uh, the segmental fractures are those type of fracture uh, where you will find at least two fracture line. In the simple way you write, at least two fracture line. Finish? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Okay, next we have discussed, uh, we did not discuss about the avulsion, right? So avulsion, you can also write avulsion fracture. A-V-U-L, A-V-U-L-S-I-O-N, avulsion fracture. You can write avulsion fracture, you can write a muscle or ligament A muscle or ligament pulls on the bone, comma, pulls on the bone, comma, fracturing it, pulls on the bone, comma, fracturing it. Let me repeat again, okay? A muscle or ligament pull on the bone, comma, fracturing it. Can you follow me? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma Are you done, all of you? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Okay, so, so in the picture itself, you can see a muscle or ligament or any uh, this uh, or any like fragment, okay? It will pull on the bone. 
फ्रैक्चरिंग इज ये बाहर पे ये आई थिंक यू कैन सी द पिक्चर द ब्रेक बोन विल पुल ऑफ एट द एंड ओके सो दैट इज व्हाट वी कॉल इट एज एवर्सन फ्रैक्चर or you can simply call that when it is a, it is a type of fracture where uh, a fragment of the bone okay the fragment of the bone will pull away it will pull away you can see the picture right so this is mainly caused by because of like because of heat because of trauma or because of accident or whatever it is okay so this type of like uh, avulsion is mainly happen because of this uh, this uh, traumatic fractions are you clear yes ma'am yes ma'am okay uh, jiban can you please take attendance done ma'am okay okay how many of them are present 23 23 ma'am Uh, is there any student who is already drop out like your classmate and all like because according to the register it is 46 but it seems like only 44 are there or what yes ma'am some some two three students drop out ma'am oh okay okay um uh, how many of them are drop out one or two Actually, ma'am, I don't have any idea. Oh, I will ask okay. mentor, ma'am, ma and I will tell you. Oh, is it okay? Okay, okay, no problem. Okay. Okay. Uh, all of you now, if you want to write it down, the other definition for a bulging fracture, you can just write it down. An a bulging fracture it occurs. You just write down. An a an a bulging fracture occurs. Occurs. when a when a small chunk of bone c h u n k when a small chunk c h u n k chunk of bone b o n e bone attached to a tendon attached to a tendon attached to a tendon or ligament gets pulled away or ligament l i g a m e n t or ligament gets pull away from the main part of the bone from the main part of the bone so i repeat done ma'am okay so no need to repeat them so this avulsion fracture na uh, this is a type of fracture when a small chunk of bone okay when a small piece of bone okay that is attached to a tendon or any or ligament okay it pull away from the main part of the bone this was the main part of the bone right but this small chunk of bone it will be like it will be um, it will be pull away okay from the main part of the bone that that we call it as avulsion So today we have discussed about the the transverse fracture, the oblique fracture, the spiral fracture, commutated fracture, green stick, toras, impacted, uh, this avulsion fracture, and segmental fracture. So uh, all of you understand uh, every type of fracture we have discussed today. Yes, ma'am. Everyone. Yes, ma'am. Do you have any questions? Yes, Do you have any questions? Ma'am, DC will send in the PDF, right? The the types of fracture. Everything I will send in the PDF. But once I complete the topic, then only I will be sending the this the notes. So, do you have any question? Anyone? Do you want to ask any question? No ma'am. No ma'am. Okay, so next class is your practical class. Now nah, I will be taking your practical class, but I will inform you all when I will be taking. Within a short minutes, I will take. At least like after ten, fifteen minutes, like that, it will take. Okay. Okay. Then for now, thank you, everyone. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am.